Hello my friend, welcome to a little bonus midweek video. I tried to go to the drive-in theaters the other day and it turns out I was a couple years too late for the movie premiere. So instead I decided to build my own drive-in movie theater. So today I'll be using and reviewing the Nebula Cosmos 4K laser projector. I wanna thank Nebula for sponsoring this video and sending me this projector. Nebula is actually Anchor's projector division and I'm really excited to test this thing out and see if it's a great portable projector for outdoor camping adventures. The first thing I thought of when I was reading about it is that this would be the greatest way to trick your family into going camping. My little brother is constantly playing video games. He's like, I don't wanna go outside, I just wanna play this video game. But what if you're like, let's go hike this volcano and go camping and then after we can watch a movie outside under the stars or play a cool video game. This is a 2400 lumen, portable laser projector with Android TV built in. And it has some of the same light source technology that are used in professional movie theater projectors, which is great for differing levels of light when you're out here camping in the woods. It has a Cortex-A 55 processor, two gigs of RAM and 16 gigs of SSD storage. It has gridless auto keystone correction and seamless autofocus. It has 30 watts of speakers. There are two 10 watt speakers for low and medium frequencies and two five watt tweeters for higher frequencies. One of the most important questions I know that I'm gonna get asked is, can you watch all your favorite movies on here? It comes with Android 10.0, which means you get access to thousands of apps, including Netflix. So you can stream lots of movies and television shows or music when you're out here camping. Or if there's a specific movie or television show or video game you wanna play, there's actually access via an HDMI port on the back as well. And what I really like about the brain of this is that it's a really nice removable dongle, can be removed from the back of the projector and upgraded in the future over time. There's still some light out right now, so let's go ahead and plug this in and see how it looks. At 2400 lumens, it's incredibly bright. It's only 10.7 pounds, which is key to camping. It doesn't weigh a lot and you can move it around wherever you need it. It comes with this really convenient remote and the projector has a sensor on both the front and the back. So you can control it from wherever you're sitting. And to test it in some light, let's watch a little mini adventure, a video inside a video. I'm gonna hit play. Let's check out this abandoned movie theater. From what I've read, this drive-in opened around 1953. It could hold around 250 cars, and it operated all the way up till around 1995, when it closed its doors and stopped showings. I'm ready for my ticket, except there's no one in the ticket booth. No tickets tonight. Well, no one's here to take my money for a ticket. Guess I'll have to build my own drive-in movie theater. Well, looks like I'm a little late for the movie premiere. This place is long abandoned. I don't even know if I could get a projector screen on there. This screen's pretty destroyed. This behind me is where all the parking spots were. It's pretty creepy in here. Assuming it would project onto the screen out there. Is that part of the old projector there on the floor? I'm not sure. Everything else in here is pretty much destroyed. This is definitely the concession room. Ugh. Probably not gonna venture in here because it looks really moldy and dangerous. Honestly surprised any of this screen is left at all. I wish I could have seen this drive-in movie theater in the midst of its heyday, but maybe one day I'll get to go to a real drive-in movie theater. The sun just passed the tree line there's still a decent amount of light out, but the resolution on here looks really good. I'm just scrolling through some of the apps on the home screen. As you can see, got Netflix, YouTube, Google Play, and YouTube recommendations. Maybe we should watch one of my videos. <laughs> and then we just flip through here too. You can see lots of the apps that are available on the Android 10.0. The first thing that's gonna happen when you get this projector set up, if you have kids, is you know they're gonna stick their eyes right in the front of the lights because that's what kids do. Yeah, this thing auto dims to help protect your eyes. At 2400 lumens, I still would not stare directly into the light, but it's a nice feature to have. Look how far away I am from the screen. And the remote still works. Let's see, we're going to YouTube. Let's see how these speakers do. Winter is here. Ooh. 
And there's something about flying through the trees, the raw elements, the mountains beside you. No concerns about yesterday or tomorrow. No sense of time or self. Quick note to remember. I'm out here, there's no one to disturb, but if you're in a campground and you have neighbors and you don't want to bother anybody around you, you can always connect this projector to Bluetooth headphones. So you can enjoy this high resolution film all through your headphones. I tested a few more clips from another one of my videos and the color and volume looked and sounded great at 4K. I'm ready for another adventure. Since I was outside, I was really worried about the wind affecting the picture since it was blowing on the projector screen. But with Nebula's autofocus and keystone correction, it handled it really well. So the graphics are amazing. I'm on a 150 inch screen in 4K out in the woods. Crazy. 2022, baby. Make this 4K laser projector your new TV, but be able to take it anywhere. Laser projection has the best quality image and color and it's the future of light projection with much more light and energy efficiency compared to other technologies. Maybe it can be a fun activity that gathers the family together, camping or not. That's it for tonight. Make sure you check out the link in the description if you're interested in learning more about the Nebula Cosmos Laser 4K projector. Thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned for my next adventure.